Yo, what's good with the YouTube? This your boy Jay Judah with the bazooka. Nothing but heat all nuclear. But listen, check this out. Check this out. This right here is for anybody who is new, who is not sure on what to make for NBA 2K21. This is your first NBA 2K. Listen, you don't know what to do. When in doubt, you can always make this build. You will never regret it. You will never waste any VC making this build right here. And then after you get good, after you get better, then go ahead and start venturing off and doing other things. All right, y'all, so check this. This is what we about to do. Go ahead and pick the power forward build, and you want to pick the pie chart right here with the most red and the most blue. Like I said, this build right here is for if you're unsure, if you're new, you don't know what to pick, make this build right here, all right? Check this out. So this is what you want to do. You want to pick the one with the most speed and preferably with a decent amount of strength, but the most speed because you'll be able to have a little bit more speed later on so basically this is what you're going to do build all the all of your uh blue all the way up all your finishing all the way up reason why is because you're going to be very dominant in the paint and then we're going to move the shooting just just the mid-range we're only moving the mid-range up to 62 and we're going to put two points on pass accuracy and then the rest is rest of everything else is going to the interior defense definitely need that perimeter I uh, don't really need that so much, but it will come in handy because of your height, lateral quickness, steals. Definitely want to bring that up. Get the, get the right badges. You're going to be dominant. Blocks definitely going all the way up. Offensive rebound up and defensive rebound all the way up. And just like that, you get a total of 50 badges. 50 badges is not bad. So check this out. Now, right here, you can either you can pick and choose which one you want to do. Now, personally. I want to, uh, cause this, this don't really matter, but I always want to make, make him look like a threat. You know what I'm saying? He looked big, burly, and swole. He gonna look like a threat. That's a mental fear striker. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Y'all, you gotta, you gotta look into these things. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, you can make the height, keep the height at six nine. But if you want just a little bit more height, I would just go with six ten, no more than six ten, just because you're gonna lose a lot of driving dunk, and driving dunks is gonna be very, 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 very important with this build right here. So I will go with six ten. Now six nine, you're gonna get better attributes, but of course you're gonna be a little bit shorter. So we're gonna go with six ten. And then we're gonna move this weight all the way up right here. Boom, acceleration. I lose acceleration and I lose speed, but I get some more strength. And watch this, I get my interior defense goes up to an 89. You know what I'm saying? So I lose driving dunks and driving layups. But watch this, go to the very next step and we're gonna maximize this wingspan. So now I get an 80 driving dunk, which is pretty good. All of the finishing goes up except for driving layups, but oh well. And I lose shooting, but shooting is just there just in case, you know what I'm saying, those close middies, you know what I'm saying, when you pass the ball or somebody pass you the ball and you accidentally go with a shot, you may be able to hit it with a 59. And then look what else I gain. I gain steals, goes up to a 70. My blocks goes up to a 91, which is definitely good for this type of build. Offensive rebound goes up to an 89. Dope. Defensive rebound to an 89. So you can't go wrong with this build right here. You got decent speed. You got decent strength. And you're dominant in the paint. Offensive and defensively. Now, right here is where you want to pick the rim protector takeover. Now, it's really up to you, to be honest. This one right here is going to get you more rebounds. That's really the only thing. And you can read when people is missing their shots. Like if they shoot it and it's not going in, then you can read it like a half second before somebody else, before they actually missed a shot or whatnot, or you know what I'm saying, a second before they missed a shot. But I like this one right here because it affects people's shots timing. You know what I'm saying? They're not making shots that they would normally make with this badge on, especially in the paint. So I'm gonna go ahead and go with the rim protector takeover, or the, <laughs> yeah, rim protect takeover. And it says we made a glass cleaning lockdown. That's cool, you know what I'm saying? We got a glass cleaning lockdown that's like a, Anthony Davis build. Now, if I would have made him 6'9", he would have been a paint beast. But it's the same build, so we're gonna go with this one right here. Like I said, if y'all enjoyed this build, <laughs> this video, if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all drop a like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what y'all think. Upgrade those badges, and you won't go wrong. You won't lose any VC. You won't waste any VC. And once you get past this building, you're like, all right, I got used to the game. I'm used to it. I want to try something else. Boom, you can make a new build, but you always have this one. This one to fall back on. It's your boy Jay Judah, and I'm out.